Imagine a world where the fiercest predators roamed the earth. Giant bears, massive saber-toothed cats, and a dog that could take on a lion. Welcome to the fascinating world of Epishan, a prehistoric canine that could literally eat lions for lunch. Epishan, which means more than a dog, was a genus of canids that lived between 5 million and 1 million years ago during the Miocene and Pleistocene epochs. This incredible creature was unlike any dog we know today, and its story is one of adaptation, survival, and evolution. But before moving on, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. Epishan is often compared to modern-day wolves, but it was so much larger. Think about this. Epishan could grow as large as a modern-day bear. In fact, it weighed between 100 to 200 pounds and stood about 3 feet tall at the shoulder. That's roughly the size of a big wolf, or even a small bear. It had long legs built for running and an elongated snout, giving it a striking appearance. But how did this massive canid stack up against other predators? Epishan wasn't just big, it was a fierce hunter. Its powerful jaws and bone-crushing teeth were designed to tackle large prey. Imagine it hunting alongside saber-toothed cats and giant deer. It likely targeted larger animals, including the formidable Megatherium, an enormous ground sloth that could weigh over a ton. The sheer size of these prey animals would have posed a challenge, but Epishan was well equipped for the job. The physical adaptations of Epishan make it particularly fascinating. Its large, robust skull housed a set of strong jaws that could crush bones and tear through flesh. This gave it a significant advantage in terms of feeding. The canine teeth were especially well developed, allowing it to deliver powerful bites. Imagine being in the wild and witnessing Epishan taking down its prey, using its powerful teeth to break through the tough hide and access the nutritious meat underneath. But what truly set Epishan apart from other predators of its time was its hunting strategy. Picture this, a pack of Epishans strategizing their hunt. Using teamwork, they would surround their prey, taking advantage of their size and strength. Unlike wolves, who often rely on speed and agility, Epishon used brute force and tactics to overpower their targets. They might have employed ambush techniques or chased down slower prey, displaying incredible endurance and coordination as a pack. Interestingly, Epishon wasn't just a hunter, it was also a scavenger. With its bone-crushing ability, Epishan could easily break through the tough bones of its prey, extracting the nutrient-rich marrow inside. This made it an efficient scavenger as well. Imagine being able to feast on leftovers from other predators. In a world where competition for food was fierce, being able to scavenge would have been a valuable survival trait. The story of Epishan is not just about its rise, but also about its downfall. The factors contributing to extinction are often complex, including climate change, habitat loss, and competition for food. Interestingly, Epishun is a crucial part of the evolutionary story of dogs. It is believed to be an ancestor to modern canids, including wolves, foxes, and yes, our beloved pet dogs. So when you think of your furry friend, remember that their ancestors were once capable of taking down creatures like lions. This connection reminds us that dogs have a long history of adaptation and survival. Here's a fun fact. Did you know that the largest dog breed today, the Great Dane, can weigh up to 200 pounds? Imagine if it had the same bone-crushing abilities as Epishon. What do you think it would hunt? Could it take down a lion? Leave your answers in the comments below. Epishan may be long gone, but its legacy lives on in the canids we see today.